The Employment Skills Center's mission is to empower people with education and training for job betterment and personal growth. We give people the knowledge and skills they need to get a better job and have a better life. They actually like walk you, you know, holding your hand through all this to get you better for the community. So that is really good. It's, you cannot get like a better help from nobody. The girls or the guys in the class, they didn't have a job at all. So it was like um, a big step for a lot of people. I have a job, but I don't want to do that for the rest of my life. So I have my license like right away. And I start putting um, applications in all like the nursing homes around here in Carlisle. And then probably like in two weeks after I put my up my applications, I start hearing like hearing from the people that I went to apply. And I feel much better now every time I finish the day because before when I leave the warehouse I didn't feel any any difference. I didn't feel like I helped some somebody. But now every day I go home I feel so good because I help them. We have a lot of heroes in this class too. That's amazing. Just last night I was preparing uh, late in the evening until about nine and I went over to Wendy's and there was one of my students working the night shift. She had homework as well and I asked her how did you do your homework? She went home at uh, 12 o'clock, did her homework then before she got to sleep, got up with the kids, got the kids off to daycare. So there are a lot of heroes that really go through, um, really have to do a lot of sacrifice in order to be here. have a lot of people around me telling me yeah well you did this you're doing really good but you need to keep going up so they are like that little push that you need to keep going up and that is good for me and it's actually good for my family at the same time so it's a really big difference you know it's a big change uh, the resources that we're in need of are always uh, more volunteers and always more charitable contributions. Uh, it's no surprise that in these economic times, uh, the demand for our services has significantly increased. And we're able to provide those trainings free to individuals only to the extent that we receive funding to do so. So we're always looking for more in the way of support so that we can provide more services in the community. And I think that uh, probably the most important thing is that we provide a return on the investment that's made through those charitable contributions. We help individuals become more self-sufficient and therefore reducing the demand on social services and increasing the taxes that are paid to help with our community. Get up in the morning and declare who you are. Not who you want to be, but who you are. You are already successful. I look at my team. I look at my team. That has journeyed with me. That has journeyed with me. And know that they too. And know that they too. Have the same uniqueness. Have the same uniqueness. And that together. And that together. We are more effective than standing alone. We are more effective than standing alone. I look to my future. I look to my future as a successful nurse aide. As a successful nurse aide. But more important. But more importantly, as a successful person. As a successful person. My success is ahead of me. And it begins today. And it begins today.